DJ Envy's claim that he's a victim of Caesar Pina, alleged real estate scam, has been contested by his former business partner. In a lengthy video posted to social media, he broke his silence on the allegation that he stole millions of dollars from investors, which have led to criminal charges and the strings of lawsuits. Just watch the video. I also apologize to the people that's still in my corner, right? But I'm at the point now that I can't communicate with anybody because now everybody's a potential co-conspirator. Everybody is a witness. Everybody is a victim, right? It's not, nobody's an investor anymore. Anybody's a victim. I invested in this company, Vision Bio. I invested 200,000, right? To give you an example, I invested in this company 200,000. Uh, it was supposed to go public. It hasn't gone public in three years. Now, am I gonna say I'm a victim of this company because the company didn't go public? Everybody's a victim. You know, and even, you know, I understand uh, DJ Envy's attorney, his defense that DJ Envy is a victim. That's the dumbest shit I ever heard in my life. Uh, me and him were partners in the real estate seminars. We were partners in a couple real estate transactions. That's it. He's not a victim. He was my partner. He was an investor. The real estate developer who goes by flipping NJ denied any wrongdoing throughout the clip. While refuting Envy's claim that he, like many others, fell victim to Pina's alleged Ponzi scheme. In August, the Breakfast Club co-host claimed to have lost $500,000 on a project with Caesar and his wife Jennifer to renovate and reposition a former school into an apartment building. His claims were made in a legal filing seeking to dismiss a lawsuit against him from two of Pina's investors, Anthony Barone and Anthony Martini who say Envy and Peanut defrauded them out of $1.5 million over an apartment complex that never materialized. So yeah, the case is still ongoing, but let me know what you think in the comments down below. Envy, Flippin' AJ, King. Today, Pro Style came. This is this is your first time picking up rent, right? First time Oof. picking up these joints, Oof. so we don't want to see the names uh, on the checks, but yeah. Oof. First time picking up rent, and that's what it's all about. When I tell you about creating generational wealth, that's what it is. I picked up, this is some of my rent. He owes me some more. His rent is picked up. Just getting started, baby. And that's what it's about. Pro Style jumped into the game. How many houses you bought? Uh, three. I'm about to hopefully close on the fourth one, right? This guy is trying to get more houses yeah. than me. He's going to start Four speaking at the seminar. We're going to be at like 12, 16 units real Oof. soon. You know what I'm saying? Oof. That's, what, that's what it's about. Teaching and learning how to do it. And that's what we're about, man. So I want to see you guys at the next seminar, February 23rd in Las Vegas. If you're on the West Coast, I want to see you there. It's at the Golden Nugget.